In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Zapier and automate two apps, which will be in this one, Airtable and Google Sheets. Okay, so here type in Google Sheets. And I have to note that I've already got Airtable and Google Sheets connected to Zapier. So you will need to do that separately. And if you get stuck, you can just message me and I can help you. And here is Airtable. And what you can do is like recommended workflows for you. So save new Google Sheet rows to Airtable. Try it. Set up your workflow. Next. And I'm going to use this uh, Google Sheet. Next. I will use Use Stories. Next. Uh, which base do you want to use? Uh, social media posts. Here we go. Next. Which table do you want to use? View stories. Next. Select the field you want to edit in Airtable. Next. So I've got all those. Day, link, topic, perfect. And go next. Ooh, let's see if it works. Yay, so it worked. So let's go next. Turn on workflow. Okay, so it's as simple as that really, but you do have to make sure that you've got headers set up. So in a second, I'll take you to my Google Sheet. Okay, so let's have a look for your record. So here, what's happened here? So let's have a look. So here, let's have a look at what this one is. Two types of drip feeding your content. So let's go to Google Sheets. And uh, I think it's this one here, Use Stories. Um, go down. Yeah, perfect. So it's updated. So pretty much it's as simple as that. But yeah, like I said, you need to make sure. So here in my Google Sheets, you'll see that I've got a very clear header here. Okay, so now let's test it to make sure it works. Okay, uh, see so we're at the end. So I did just add in one there. So we'll add in another one. So 11th of March, um, just type in that and Saturday. Saturday post. So now let's go to Airtable. So we'll refresh that. I'm not sh quite sure how long it takes before it converts over or transfers over, I should say. So here. Okay, so 11th of March. Go to Airtable. It might take a minute or so. Uh, so here we go social media posts. So we're in new stories. So you see the 10th of March, which I added just a moment ago. Well, not the one just in this tutorial, I added it a few minutes ago and that's here. So that's definitely showing. But the other one, the 11th of March, I think it actually takes a minute or so. Um, that's how long this one here took, but it's working. So what I've showed you in this tutorial definitely works. And if you've got any questions, please comment below.